Right, up next, Motto. Let's go, please. Here, you go, chef. Let's go, Motto. Right, describe your bird. All right, this is like country quail come to town. So the yeah. country quail has yeah. taken flight and landed in the city. Well, he, he took a dip in a brine over there and then got a quick snack of stuffed himself with some thyme and bay leaf and then had to throw on his pinstripes. I was just waiting on the rest <laughs> of the party. Mata's quail looks like he had half a bottle of tequila and he's just kind of like perched like on a wall just looking at a drunk. <laughs> looks good. Yeah, it does look really good. good. Do you want the cauliflower this raw? A little texture um, to kind of break that puree. I think a little bite in the cauliflower would do the dish nice. The awkwardness of this is the raw cauliflower. Yes, it's textured, but just maybe smaller florets. Uh, but it's a bloody good quail. Nailed it. Good job. Thank you, chef. Uh, really good. He's got it. Right, next up, Heather. Let's go, please. OK. Chef, I took the wings and the legs off of the quail because I stuffed the cavity with a little bit of parsley, lemon, and some of the leeks. When I see Heather's dish, I'm looking like, where is the quail? Like, where did the quail go? So did you use the legs, uh, wings, for any of it? I didn't, Chef. No. What's the stuffing here? What is that? Lemon? I just lemon, parsley, um, some of the leek. When you've got that lemon in there, mm -hmm. it turns it bitter. Like, if you put a lemon on it, you take it out. Rookie mistake. Cauliflower, delicious. Eggplant, exceptional. So everything else works beautifully, it's except the lemon. the lemon. Gotcha. Thank you. I got chunks of lemon still. Mm. I can't catch a break today. At all. One more dish. Brent, describe your dish, please. So I have a uh, Herbs of Provence char grilled quail served with a cauliflower puree. A bit much on that puree, but it looks kind of yeah, cool. Yeah, it, it looks good. Yeah. Char-grilled eggplant topped with a uh, lemon zest and herb bromelada. Look at that dish, and I don't think you've done it because you're quite a robust man. You've nailed that. Quail now, puree, smart intuition. Eggplant's the only bit that doesn't match uh, the rest of the high standard that you put on the plate. But it's a bloody good effort. Thank you. Thank you, Chef. Hopefully, I got a winner, winner, quail dinner. <laughs> I feel like Brett and Motto are coming back. Yep. Based on this last uh -huh. performance, oh my god. Time to find out who is going to make it into that elite group and be joining Ariel and Mia in that incredible black jacket lounge. Oh my god, who is it? Who is it? The next chef to receive the coveted black jacket is Congratulations, Brett. Thank you, Chef. Amazing. Hell yeah, yo. Yeah, baby. This one's for y'all, I said. This one is for y'all. My parents, man. Off you go. Chef. I feel ecstatic right now. Surreal, euphoric, phenomenal black jacket. Hell yeah, yo. Are they here? Who is it? Who is it? Who is it? Yeah! Yeah! Yeah, yeah boy! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, yo! He's not my favorite in the competition, but I'm happy for him. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you mama, were watching this one's for me. Right well, the reason I'm a chef is because my mother and my father. That's for them right there. You know, they was really rooting for me on my original season when they were still alive. That's what I'm talking about. So this one was definitely for them. Definitely for them. Damn, I look good in this coat. <laughs> Oh, dear. Can I have a motto? This is tough. Um, Man, I really do not want to go into sudden death third round of this today. Come on, chef. Just just call that name real quick that, that you know I want to hear. Please get me out of this red coat. Joining Mia, Brett, and Ariel in the Black Jacket Lounge is motto. Great job. Well done. The brine, chef. the flavor, brilliant. Sure. Really good indeed. Well Thank done. Thank you, Chef. Excellent. Thank you. Well done indeed. I got a black jacket, you know, kind of solidifying the fact that I do belong here. Now I'm starting to, to find myself even more through my cooking and everything else. And I think people might should watch out for me. You are part of a very elite club. 
please, Christina is going to escort you down to I that incredible lounge. Good job. Come Thank on, you, Christina. Good job.